Hello guys, Photoshop tutorial here, and yes, I made the plunge. If you've seen my unboxing video, I did buy CS5, so we are now using Photoshop CS5. And we're actually going to be using one of the new features, which is Content Aware Fill, um, but we're going to be using it with the Spot Healing Brush. So we're going to be looking at removing spots, pimples, whatever, from a face. Um, I mean, as naturally beautiful as she is, she does have spots and pimples and other marks that make her less attractive in the magazine standard world, if you know what I mean. Okay, so hit the J key in your key keyboard that's going to come up with the uh, spot healing brush. If it doesn't, hold down shift and press J and cycle until it comes up with the spot healing brush. And what we want to do is make sure that content aware is checked on. And we can literally just click on the pimple. And that's going to look around the image to find other spots similar and get rid of the spot we're selecting. So it's pretty, pretty genius and really speeds up the process. I mean, I know Spot Healing Brush did this in CS4, um, but not as good. And when I was removing stuff, um, in CS4 I would often have to use the clone stamp tool which I now find less of a need of with content aware fill um, however I do still use it to touch up larger areas if I was using say the content aware fill on a larger selection then we do have needs for it so we might not just got rid of that ring, however that didn't come out the best. Let's decrease the size of our brush. There we go. Got rid of the ring. We don't want her to look like she's taken, even though that's the wrong hand. And very quickly we've gone through and we've removed unwanted marks, etc. Um, so that, in a nutshell, is the Spot Healing Brush with the new Content Aware Fill powers. Um, that's how you use it. You can see if we um, compare, if we if we save that Command Shift S to save as. We look at the original. Oh, turn it off in there. Compare them. There you go. So thank you for watching, see you guys soon, watch my other Photoshop tutorials, and if you like my tutorials then subscribe, and also follow me on Twitter because I do tweet about upcoming videos, so thank you very much.